and gentlemen, and welcome back to Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. I chose Eevee. I, I do plan on getting Pikachu. I've said this before in my Let's Play, but I do plan on getting uh, Pikachu in the future, and that's going to be my backup copy. This is the save that I'm just never going to touch. I mean, that kind of worked out. <gasps> Don't snort at me! Oh my god, okay. If I've been. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. There you go. Good boy. I think it's a boy. I'm used to saying good boy regardless because I have Link, so yeah, there's that. All right, we're going to Sky Dash on over. We have the final gym today. We have the final gym. I was shiny hunting for a Magikarp. I have a 32 catch combo, so I might break that. I might not. I might come back to that after this. Because after this recording, I'm going to set it to... I'm going to edit the video, and then I'm going to go on over to the treadmill. Go on there for about an hour. So I might shiny hunt during that. I haven't decided yet. I, I might play Hearthstone. I hit Legend and Hearthstone uh, fairly easily. I went like 11-1 and one with uh, Mildruid. None of you know what I'm talking about, but it's fine. I really like Hearthstone. <laughs> I'm a dork. I'm a dork. I really do want to get the... Wait, why am I going over here? I was like... I was... Pre I thought that was a shiny. I thought that was a shiny Rattata. Um, I was preparing to go to Elite Four. That's where you go to get the Elite Four. There's also new Pokemon to capture over there. I'm pretty sure I read something about Execute and Executor being over there. I have not seen an Execute. I haven't seen. Never seen. So I don't think there's another place to capture them. I, like... I've tried capturing all the Pokemon I can. Huh? Why is the door locked? Open sesame. Is that gonna work? I think I have all seven gym badges. Sheesh, say something if you're just standing there. Watch me act embarrassing like, well, the dude over there is watching you too. Well, never mind that. So how many? So seven? We're even. And all that's left is the Viridian City Gym. But this place is never open. I guess we've got to... Is it gonna just like open randomly? But who should we talk to? That old man there. What, me? I don't know anything like that. Why is he just standing there then? All right, Professor Oak, I guess. Okay. I guess we're going to Professor Oak. Oh, here's Gary. I got a few people asking me why I call him Gary. The reason is because that is Gary from the anime. Like, that's fairly obvious to everyone that's watched the anime if you haven't watched it that's why i call him gary in this game i think he's called blue or something like that his his, his anime name was gary so that's why i call him that you two are both looking a lot more grown-ups since the last time i saw you and it you have a peckle typing as usual let me introduce you this is my grandson and um, what was his name okay that was such a yeah his name is blue um that was such a reference to red and blue where he couldn't remember his names and you got to name them yourself Namely, like, doo, -doo head. Stupid. <laughs> Sheeble! <laughs> you two did awesome. Huh? With Team Rocket, I never thought that their boss would actually be holed out in the Sylph Cove. No, it wasn't me, H. Bobby Giovanni. Yeah, thank you. Okay, I'm over this talking. As a reward, here we go. We got a keystone. Isn't the keystone for a spirit tomb? Oh, I never fixed the desktop audio. There we go. Sorry, the audio might be a little weird. But it should be fixed now. You put the keystone in your... Is that the keystone? A trigger evolution. Oh, it's Mega Evolution! What was it called for Spiritomb? Hang on, I'm pulling up my sweatpants right now because it's hot in here. I just got out of the shower, don't judge me. Mega Evolution, what's that? If you hold both the keystone and the Mega Stone, you can Mega Evolve. I forgot that was actually in the game. I'm not gonna... Well, I mean, I might. We do have Charizard... I think that's the only one of my Pokemon that Mega Evolve. We don't have... Oh, Alakazam as well. Oh, yeah. What's happening? The two of you should be able to use these. These are Mega Zones. Yeah, there we go. Basically, Mega Evolution is kind of broken. Um, it's really, really overpowered. Really, really strong. Still a question to this day why they introduced it. It's kind of cool, but it's kind of dumb at the same time. I don't know. I'm kind of indifferent about it. Oh, we have Mega Slowbro, too. Actually, wait. No, I don't have Slowbro on my team. I need to fix that. I was I was evolving Pokemon, so I got Slowbro, in case you're wondering. Um, we gotta get our team back to normal. Uh, Charizard. Add to party. Uh, we need to get rid of Omanyte and Rhyhorn. We need... What are we missing? Uh, we're missing... Oh, my God. What am I blanking? Uh, Kabutops and one other. Kabutops and... Oh, God, give me a moment. Oh, Electabuzz, that's who it was. 
I was like, I, I'm pretty, in my mind, I was like, I think it's an Electro-type, but I haven't been using Raichu. And there's Kabutops. Thank you. These Pokemon should be fine during this. Uh, Electabuzz and Kabutops aren't going to be too useful, although Kabutops is a water type. It's only got Aqua Jet, and it gets kind of destroyed by like, Earthquake and things like that. I think my best bets for this gym is probably going to be Charizard, because he's got a lot of ground types, but also rock types, so maybe not. Janky is going to be amazing during this gym, though. All right, let's see what we can do. Is that it? Can I go? What do you have to say? You two are so close to the Pokemon League. Okay, thanks. Is the gym gonna be like open now? Are we gonna have some more storyline? Yeah. Hi, Evie. Oh, maybe not. Evie! Are we going to mom? Oh no, he's going to the flowers. Oh, if it isn't Evie. You want, you want to know what I'm doing. I'm picking flowers. I'm gonna make a bouquet for someone very important. But it's a secret. You won't tell anyone, right, H? Oh, that's right. The Viridian City gym leader's back. Okay, cool. Don't steal her flowers, Evie. All right. <laughs> That's my cocky little Evie. Looks displeased and is gazing around. Okay. You you keep being displeased. I haven't given him any berries. I haven't figured out how to give him berries. There's like a berry button in the bottom right, and I like choose a berry, but I don't know how to individually give it to him. Like he just won't accept it. It just like slowly like drops on the screen. So I've kind of given up on it. We need to heal before we go in here. I don't want to buy any potions because I can't be bothered. I want I want to spend all my money on lures and uh, <laughs> ultra balls and stuff like that, so I can't be bothered to get any potions. This game hasn't been very hard for me, so it's 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 a very easy game so far. So I'm not too worried about blacking out or anything like that. I'm probably gonna have to heal up before. Like I don't have good typing for this gym other than janky. So, I might need to come back and heal up before uh, we take on Giovanni. <gasps> Spoilers. We're taking on Giovanni again. Wow, what a surprise. The evil mastermind behind behind uh, Team Rocket. Wowzers. Oh my goodness. Wow, I never would have suspected a thing. I remember not being able to figure out where the Aether Gym was when I was little. I mean, like, I came here during the beginning of the game, and then I was just like, oh, but it's closed. I just kind of assumed that it was going to stay closed. Um. No. I mean, do I just go for it and just go? Sure, why not? Okay, well, it looks like I have to go a certain way. Okay, so th this way was literally useless, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's literally useless. Like, I can't get that guy to move out of the way, so whatever. Thanks, game. Love that for us, game. Uh, let's go. We have to go this way. We have to battle this guy and go back to the left. I have no options here. It all just leads back to, like, the beginning. Link. Can you stop playing with the blanket, you weirdy? He's a little weirdy, in case you're wondering. Samuel. That's bad typing for me. Oh, I forgot the janky screen! <laughs> oh, I, I, I totally forgot that he's like in lime. He puts the lime in the coconut. Yeah, we have... Oh, we have Dig, actually. I forgot about Dig. That's... Okay. Janky's going down first! <laughs> I didn't think about Earthquake. Oh, no. It's fine. Don't worry about it. This is all part of my master plan. What level is he? Uh, Alakazam should just be able to one-shot him. Level 48. So yeah, he was a level higher than Janky. Same level as Alakazam, though. I'm kind of disappointed because now Janky is not going to get the XP that I want him to. Nice and easy game. Do I want to heal or do I want to just revive? I kind of just want to revive. I don't want to keep making trips back and forth. If I wasn't recording, I would make trips back and forth. But for the sake of the content, let's just go ahead and go into our medicine cabinet. Revive. Use this item on Janky. And we do have some hyper potions. Yeah, we're just going to use the super potions to get them out of our inventory. I'm just going to use one. I'm not too worried, like I said before. We should be okay. We should be dandy. 
Is he gonna battle us? Yes, he is. Okay, so I don't think I could ever avoid that battle. A little annoying. I like having the option to avoid it. But this gets us some um, XP as well. God, why does everyone have Nidorinos and like the Nidoran family? And when I throw out Janky first. I, I mean, does Nidorino naturally have Earthquake? Probably. I'm not. I'm not falling for that mistake again. Let's just send out Charizard, right? I'm gonna call that he's gonna Earthquake me. So we get a free switch into Charizard. Easy prediction. Easy clap. Nah, dang it. I don't think he has Earthquake. I think I learned Earthquake when I became a Nido King. And I'm poisoned. Oh, I'm not poisoned. Nice. Uh, just Flamethrower. Oh, I could Mega Evolve! I might, I might as well Mega Evolve. That would have one-shot him. Oh, uh, feels bad. Alright, yeah, Mega Evolve. Uh, we want to do Y. Mega Evolve Y. And go for Flamethrower. If we would have Mega Evolved Y, we... Oh, wait, no, there's no abilities in this game, is there? I was thinking, like, oh, the sun comes out. And it becomes, like, sunny. Yeah, so no. Might not have... It probably... Like, it... When you Mega Evolve, your special attack goes up, so it might have done it. Might have is the keyword there. So I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to do math in my head. I don't want to anymore. Uh, I mean, can we send out Kabutops and one shot him? Let's try it. I want him to learn, like, Waterfall or something like that. I don't think I had. I, I checked it a while ago if, if I had Waterfall as a TM, and I didn't. I might have picked it up since then. Oh, did I? I forgot I have a table there now. Hang on, I threw Link's... I have a table in my house now, or my apartment. And I threw Link's toy, and I'm used to it just going... Oh, wait, no, it didn't like... Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Okay, no, you have it. You liar. It one-shot him? Nice, it did. Aqua Jet's a priority move. It's, a, it's a, basically like a water quick attack. So it's not that strong, and Rhyhorn has a lot of defense, but it's four times weak to it. I don't know. I, I need Kabutops to learn a better water type move than just that. Cool. Another battle. What a surprise. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. I feel like I'm not. I feel like I'm just going into complete loop de loop. Do all of them have, like, the Nido family? Is that what I'm going up against? The one time that I put, like, freaking Janky up front. <laughs> All right, prediction again. There's no way she's not going for something like Earthquake or Dig or something like that, right? Right? It's, it's She's going for a Ground-type move. Thank you. Easy prediction. Uh, we're going to Mega Evolve into Y. If you evolve into X, it becomes a Fire Dragon-type, which means Ground-type moves are super effective and hit me. So... <laughs> We evolve into Mega uh, Evolution Y in this game. Mega Evolution X or is way cooler, but and it's also black. Black Charizard is the coolest. Um, but in this gym, it's not gonna make sense to do that. Actually, this is resisted. Why did I go for this? It's still gonna two-shot him though. Yeah. I resist that. It's fine. It's not stab either. What happened? Okay, Nita Queen's attack and defense fell. Cool. Flamethrower again, cause why not? Watch me low roll this time, and she survives. Thank you. I didn't want to take another hit. Although, its attack was lowered, so I would have been fine. Janky, I need you to level up a little bit. Thank you, buddy. I also have 10 rare candies. Just throwing that out there. Just trying to flex a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Yep, we did a complete circle. Literally a complete circle. Oh, but we got an item. Be it like Earthquake. Give me Earthquake. I feel like this actually might be the team for Earthquake. Or Giovanni might give me Earthquake. I don't remember what Giovanni... I think Giovanni did give me Earthquake in red and blue. Okay. This is fine. This is Poison Resist fighting, by the way, which is why I kept switching Janky out, because literally all Janky can do is Brick Break and Seismic Toss. God, this can still do a lot. Earthquake is such a good move. Earthquake's like base 100. God dang it. 
is base 100. And, uh, like, from Dark Trio, it's stab, so it goes to base 150. From Nido Queen and Nido King, it's base 150 as well because they have stab. It's insane. Watch this prediction. Look at these plays. Look at this rock slide about to hit me. Look at these plays. A oh, sucker punch, what the hell? Alright. Look at those plays. Genius. I didn't want Kabutops taking an earthquake, which is why I switched him in after I switched into Charizard. I mean, I should have kept in Charizard if I thought he was going to go for Sucker Punch, but I assume that he had a, uh, some sort of, uh, rock move. It's fairly common to see, like, uh, ground-type Pokemon with rock moves, like Rock Slide or Stone Edge or something like that. Or even Rock Throw, I guess. And Charizard gets absolutely molly by that. Oh, cool. This is going to hurt quite a bit. Luckily, Aqua Jet has priority, so there's no way that Rhyhorn will outspeed me. Thank you. Now we could heal up. Also, there's no more coffee in this. I, I'm drinking ice. That's all I'm drinking right now. God, you only gain 275 from a Rhyhorn? I catch Magikarp that give me more XP than that. Through all my Pokemon. This game's trash. This game's terrible. Medicine. Uh, That's just Hyper Potion all around. It's just easier. <laughs> when I feel lazy, I just start using Hyper Potions. Normally I try saving them, but oh well. I think Hyper Potions do 200 in this game. I don't know. They mess with uh, the potions a lot recently. They revive. All right. So, yeah. We did a complete circle. Took on three... Bi <sighs> we took on three people in order to freaking get a revive. So, we have to go this way. Cool. Wait, what? What? How do, how do we get in there? I messed up somewhere. I totally messed up somewhere. Wait, what? <laughs> am I blind? Or am I just stupid? Did I mess up at the beginning? Do I have to go this way? Oh, I do have to go this way. What was I doing before? Oh, he was blocking it. That's why I couldn't go this way beforehand. Oh! Okay, that makes more sense. So the top guy is probably going to have a fighting type Pokemon. This guy, I feel like, is going to have another... Let's take on the fighting dim. I, I don't want to take on any more Needle Kings. I'm done with Needle Kings. The Karate King. Okay, so he's probably going to have, like, Primate. Or Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee. Or Kangaskhan. For some reason, I feel like he's just got a Kangaskhan. Grab it. Why... I switched out Janky because I was like, oh, Alakazam, well, I mean, Alakazam probably can still one-shot this, but still. This would be good XP for Janky. <laughs> I love Alakazam. I don't have the Alakazamite, so I can't Mega Evolve him. We got the charizard Ites and Venusaurite and Blastoiseite from Blue earlier. There we go. Oh my god, he's such a badass. All right, who are we starting off with? Who's going to be my worst Pokemon through here? Let's start off with, uh, Golem. Golem can set up, set up Stealth Rocks as well. And then if he goes down, we can switch him. I don't think Golem's going to get one-shot by any of his Pokemon, even like Nidoking or Nidoqueen. He's such a badass. Fwahaha, welcome to my hideout. It shall be so until I can return to Team Rocket's step forward. That's so bad. I'm not holding back. Once more, then. You shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. I mean, he's a gym leader. He's not the champion. He's not the greatest trainer. He's a bit cocky. For someone who doesn't hold the right to be cocky. He's got four Pokemon. Doug Trio. We should easily... Like, I feel like an Earthquake from... Doug Trio is going to be do, do, do about 75%. I feel. I'm not positive about that. It's going to outspeed me as well. Or the same level, so I feel like 75% is a good judge. A little bit less, like 60. Alright. 
I got the stealth rocks up, which might not be that huge in this battle, but still. I didn't know who he was going to start off with, so just being able to start off with Golem and take any hit that he threw out just feels good. We're going to go down. I know he's going to go down. I don't feel like switching him out. If I switch into anyone, who would it be? I'm not sure if Kabutops can one-shot this thing with uh, Aqua Jet. We're gonna Mega Evolve Charizard into Mega Charizard X. He's got too many Pokemon that probably have... Probably have, uh, what's it called? Uh, Rock-type moves. So, with this we get super effective against... Earthquake and, like, Ground-type moves. But, in return, we don't, we're not four times weak to... Stupid uh, rock type moves. So I'm okay with that. There was no move. Wing attack might be my strongest move right now because we're in. Uh, it's stab as well. This is gonna hurt. Yeah. Okay, we're fine. He's dead. That's all that matters. So when you evolve into Mega Charizard X, I'm pretty sure your attack and defense go up. If you evolve into Mega Charizard Y, your special attack and special defense go up and speed. I think speed goes up for both. <sighs> Needle Queen. I already sent out Needle Queen. Huh. Alakazam should be able to one shot it. Or at least get really, really close. I hope. I don't think Alakazam could take a Earthquake too well. I feel like it'll bring me down to the red. A stab Earthquake from a level 49. Ooh. Stealth Rock's coming in handy. Good job, Golem. You did good, buddy. This is gonna make sure that I knock him out. Thanks, Golem. You did your chance. Oh, it was a critical hit. Yeah, you were getting one shot regardless. Sorry. There we go. Alakazam grew a level. Now we're on par. Special attack went up. <laughs> Special attack is destroying everyone. Janky grew level 48. Good. Wants to learn superpower. Ooh. Yes. Uh, I never use seismic toss. I got superpower. We're not super powerful, buddy. How great is that? How do you stand? That's pretty neat. That's what Link says, by the way, not me. That's pretty neat. I'm just sending out Nido King. I mean, I'm gonna keep Alakazam in. Going down, buddy. I I can't. Why? What's his last Pokemon? Isn't it right on? I mean, is isn't his last Pokemon right on? Am I crazy? Okay, cool. Why would you not send that out first? I'm gonna switch out to, uh, oh, Janky. Janky got no time during this. I thought Janky was gonna have a good time in this gym. He just didn't have any chances. Come on out, Janky. We'll use our super strong superpower. Even though it's definitely not the best move against this guy. Actually, it's really not the best move. We're just gonna use Brick Break. I should outspeed it. And if I use superpower, I get one shot by Earthquake. This way, we can at least survive. Still alive, but I'm barely breathing. Now we get superpower, because we got speed. Boom! We could have just brick break and ensured the win, but who cares? That's not fun. We like to have fun by superpowering people. He does look like a superhero, too. Namely, the Hulk. Alright. <laughs> This game is so easy. I need to do a challenge on this game. I need to like get Let's Go Pikachu and I need to do a Nuzlocke or something. Like I feel like I'm not being pushed as a trainer. Yeah, there's Earthquake, nice. I feel like I'm gonna teach like all my Pokemon that can learn it, Earthquake. It's such a busted move. I'm not listening. I can't face my followers after being defeated like this. Team Rocket is as of today finished. As for myself, I shall decide my dedicate my life to Pokemon training again. Cool. <laughs> let us again meet. Farewell. Alright, let's see who can learn an earthquake. The best move in any Pokemon game ever created. The most unbalanced move ever created. 
Uh, is there anything else I should teach? I have no interest in teaching like Charizard Fire Blast. One of my Pokemon can learn this move. It's still 100% worth it. Like, Janky has Dig, which in every universe, Dig is an upgrade unless my opponent's like poisoned or something. And doesn't have Earthquake. Why can't Kabutops learn Earthquake? Am I the only one that thinks that's bogus? Oh my god. Okay, I have to go this way. I have to take the long way around. So I think I actually did the gym correctly. I thought I did it wrong, but I'm pretty sure that I had to go do the full circle so I could move that dude. And that's why I was forced to battle him. Congrats, kid. Boy, though, what a shock. I never thought a criminal would be to use a Pokemon gym as a hideout. I'll be the gym leader from now on. I mean, I want to battle you. I'm going to say that's great, though, because I'm not healed. So then, H-Bomb. Time for you to take on... Just keep going along. Okay, cool. I mean, I'm going to heal up and then come back and ba see if he wants to battle still. I'm down for that, because why not? You know what I'm saying? But, like, I just beat a gym leader. I don't want to battle someone again immediately. I'm not sure if I'm fully healed. I should probably check if I was fully healed, but... We'll go back and talk to him really quick, because I'm pretty sure he'll want to battle again. And then we'll head towards the Elite Four. Dun, 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 dun. Look at that team. It's not really that well-rounded, but I like the... I like all of these Pokemon. I really do. They're just cool. They're... Other than, like, Charizard, all of them are kind of unique, and not many people use them. And like let's plays at least like let's look at this who uses kaboot tops and like any let's play other than this electabuzz janky like these are like all evolution pokemon that i've never been able to use before because i've never been able to evolve during let's play like i've never actually like traded someone a machoke in order to get my champion oh he's gone is he in here oh, i don't want to go through here he might have been in there I missed my chance to battle him, but I didn't want to battle him right after I took on a gym leader. That's dumb. Why? Why? Why, Link? Why? You want to come up here? Come on. I need you to sit down now. Oh, no. Not step on my cord. Thank you. You're nuts. Give me a shiny. Nope. Of course not. Oh, dude, you smell. I already battled you. Do I have to battle you again? I finally caught up to you. I got an Earth Badge too. That finally means... Oh, wait. Did he beat Gary? Or Blue? Sorry. Oh, great. I get, we get to battle him again. Yay! He's like, why do you do this to me? Why do you torture me so? He's only got four Pokemon. Pidgeot. Pidgeot. Whatever his name is. Oh, dude. You smell. Going down. You actually do smell. Gross. I think he came up here and farted. Alright, um, do we go for the stuff? Yeah, we might as well go for it. <sighs> Is that how he got the gym badges? Really? Why does a Pidgeot level 50 have sand attack? Please just one shot him. Please hit. Please hit. This has got such a low chance of hitting. Oh, thank you. I love you, Golem. Okay. I just need you to land a headbot. A headbot. Oh my god, he's literally a hacks master. I might have to switch out to, uh... I'm going to. Switch out to Electabuzz. I think that's by far my best bet. Dude, I gotta give you a bath or something. You smell terrible. I don't know if he just literally came over here and farted, but it smells awful and I can't take it. Dude, come on! Use like, a, use like a normal type move on me now that I'm not rock. Just use tackle. And let me kill you. There you, there you go. Quick at, He's got quick attack and sand attack. Does he still have gust? Please hit this. Please hit this. What is this? This isn't super effective because he used Roost. 
Oh no. Dude, you smell. Did you poop? Like, what happened? Why does it smell so bad? Okay, I need you not to roost now so I can kill you. Dude, come on! Sand attack, quick attack, roost. Am I missing something here? Luckily, I've been hitting these. There's a critical hit. I needed the one that was super effective to be critical hit. What is this? Why did they program this nonsense into the game? Okay, now he's probably not gonna go for roost, right? Go for quick attack. I'm gonna spam A for a minute, don't mind me. I'm looking up how much PP roost has. Roost Pokemon. It's gotta have 10 PP. Okay, it's got 10 PP. So the most he could have now, as far as I'm aware, is like four. I haven't missed a Thunderbolt, which is awesome. I know the moment that I go for something like Light Screen, he's going to use like Quick Attack or something like that, or Sand Attack. He's gonna use Sand Attack. Oh my god, thank you. Wow, I forgot that I could paralyze him. Kill him. Kill him. Thank you. That was so dumb! That was literally not fun. Why would they make some- Like, this is a battle that I have to do. Why would they do that to this game? Why would they literally just make it not fun? This is a battle that you can't avoid! Why? <sighs> Alright, I'm done ranting. That was just so stupid. Like, a level 50 Pidgeot should not have sand attack. Or quick attack. Shouldn't have either of those. I don't know what his last move was. He should have Roost. Roost makes sense. You okay, buddy? I know, you smell. I know. I might have to stop recording and give him a bath or something. No, you're not coming back up here. There's no universe where you're coming back up here. There's not. Thunder? No. Keep holding moves. Thunder's just not worth it. It misses too much. Thunderbolt's such a good move. No, no, Link, I said no. I said no coming up here. Down. You smell. <laughs> he just, like, forced his way onto my lap. Oh, did I not switch? Ah, Link. Ah, oh, whatever. I might be able to one-shot him. Probably not, though. He's gonna hurt. He's gonna hurt me a lot. Yeah, he's got good special defense. Oh, Thrash. Okay, that's not... At least that's not, like, Earthquake. Oh, wow. Earthquake might have one-shot me. This is close. This is really close. Okay, good. The reason why I was close wasn't because, like, I got him in the yellow. I hit, He was hit by Stealth Rocks before I used uh, Psychic, so it was, like, kind of like a 50-50 of me knocking him out there, I think. Alright, Raichu. Go. The ultimate counter to Raichu, unless he's got, like, Brick Break or something weird like that. Or Focus Blast. Please don't have Focus Blast, dude. I'm actually going to stop this recording after this battle and go give him a bath. He needs a bath. I don't know why he smells so bad. It doesn't really smell like a fart, it's just he smells terrible. And he needs a bath. This will one-shot this Raichu. He's got slam. Don't paralyze me! Okay, good. That's 100% killing him. 150 super effective base power is 300 damage from Golem. Raichu doesn't have that good of defense. It has, like, no defense, basically. I'm calling for level 50. Alright, we're getting well-rounded now, at least. And his HP went up, so that's actually one of the better ones to go up. I've raised my Pokemon this much and you could still beat me. Alright, I'm gonna go give him a bath. I'll be right back. I've always felt like I needed to look after you, ever since I, I, I gave him a bath, in case you're wondering. Ever since we were young. But I think I think you're the one who has more talent as a trainer. It's frustrating. I've never felt this way before. Can you, like, heal my Pokemon now that you've hurt them? No? Dude, stop being a baby. Such a sheeble thing to do. Such a sheeble thing to do. What a sheeble thing to do. <laughs> Alright, I'm done. Alright, now we get to go to the Pokemon League. The pinnacle of Pokemon training, front gate. So, this will basically... You can go through here step by step depending on how many gym badges you have. 
I have eight. So this guy will stop me and check me for the boulder badge. The boulder badge. Oh, yeah, that's the boulder badge. Go right ahead. <clears throat> sorry for sorry for ruining your day. Sorry for slowing you down. Just continue through here. No, the cascade badge, I believe. Can I name all the badges? I don't think I'm going to be able to name anymore. Oh, it's Lieutenant Surge's badge. It's like a lightning badge or something weird like that. Thunder badge. I was close. Thunder was too obvious to me, so I was like, it's not thunder. It's got to be like lightning. You can tell by Lieutenant Surge's autograph. Cool. Uh, the fourth gym. Is it Erica's gym? The flower badge. Rainbow badge. Dang it. I actually knew that one. Ah, crap. I actually knew the rainbow badge was a badge. I, I thought it was Sabrina for some reason that had that. That looks like a normal trainer. Is it a normal trainer? Oh, no, it's not. Soul badge. I wouldn't have guessed that. I wouldn't have guessed that was the nice one yet. Oh, item. Sweet. Any items in here? Okay, so there's no items other than just this. Oh, nice! Oh, hell! Those are my first golden raspberries! Yes, please. You can only pass this a marsh badge. Cool. Who gives us the marsh badge? I actually have no idea who gives the marsh badge. Normally there's like polywags and stuff in here. Oh, is there like a secret item back there? There might be a secret item back there. No, there's just magic carp. Cool. I, I think I still have a catch combo on them. <laughs> Probably gonna ruin that here. Because like I said, there's executes over here. Golden and nab bears, ew. Not too interested in that. Alright, let's see what pops out around here. I need the executes. Sorry, I'm ruining my 32 catch combo in order to get this with magic card. I, I want the executes. This is my first time encountering or even seeing them in this game. It's an execute. Just stay in the ball. I think you evolve execute into executor by the leaf stone. I believe stone. <laughs> uh. Oh, thank God. I just barely got that nice in there. That'll do it, right, execute? Nice. Alright, I could buy the leaf stone. I think I have a leaf stone, so I don't really have to worry about that. Um, I don't know if there's gonna be anything else in here. I hope there's another Pokemon in here that I don't have yet. You know, I'm gonna throw down a lure right here, really quick. No, Fira, go away. Uh, back. Let's throw down a lure and see if anything pops up. We have to go through a cave as well, so this lure might stay in. Oh, god dang it, right. We had a beeline right for me. I didn't have time to avoid it. Stupid bird no one likes. Does anyone actually like Firo? Does anyone like Firo? Like, is anyone like, I really can't wait to use Firo in my Let's Play? Has anyone done a Nuzlocke and be like, oh boy, a Firo? First Pokemon I caught on this, on this route was a Spiro. Yes! I guess people that wanted to trade Spiro for... Far-fetched, maybe? <laughs> that would make sense. Oh, God, stop. Stop! There's got to be some sort of rare Pokemon in here, right? Right? 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. All right, we're getting out of here. Wait, one... Well, is it another Nidorino? It is another Nidorino. That's what I got for looking back. I saw something that was like purple and I was like, oh, that could be a shiny. Because there's a lot of shiny purple Pokemon. So I was like, oh, that could be it. That's a Nidorina. Volcano badge. Cool. So we have one more badge to go through. There's more grass up here. I just saw a Pokemon over there. There's an item there. Executes the final boss to get this item. Dude, pick it up. I mean, in the future, that might be good. Right now, I don't care for it. Another execute. No rare Pokemon. The Earth Badge. Alright, we made it to the Victory Road. This is a very tough cave. Alright, let's see what spawns around here. Goal bats. Oh boy. Okay, so I can't do anything this way right now. I have a lure on. Oh, no, not Zubat. 
Yes. I like all the Pokemon that could like pop up. It's Golbat and Zubat. Cool. I know there's gonna be at least Onyx in here. I unexpected. <laughs> I would be very. It would be very unexpected if he didn't show up here. How many times has that Pokemon pun been used? Way too many is the answer. Okay, another Golbat. Sweet. Show me some cool po- Oh, Machoke. I thought it was a Machamp. I got really excited. I was like, oh my god, can I find Machamp? This is an area where you can grab both of them. I'm not gonna battle you. I don't feel like battling you right now. Is there an item right here? No, thanks, Eevee. Okay, so you're, like, you're supposed to choose which one you go back to. I think one was a TM and one's a rare candy. I don't remember which one's which. But I'm pretty sure I could come back- Oh, Stealth Rock. Um, I'm pretty sure I could come back here and fix that. Like, it'll go back to normal. I was really hoping that I didn't have to battle her. Well, next episode is pretty much going to be me taking on the Elite Four and the Champion. Next episode should be, should be the final episode. It shouldn't take over an hour to actually finish this game from right here. Do I have Janky out front? I don't think I do. I think I have Golem. Yeah. Dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. I mean, Golem works, but I'm pretty sure that Kangaskhan's gonna at least have, like, Brick Break or Low Kick or something like that. Right? Outrage. A Dragon-type move. That was your best move to use against me. Golem doesn't have that good of attack, and that still does half the damage to the freaking Kangaskhan. That's kind of nuts. That's how Busted Earthquake is as a move. Also, in, like, double battle, it hits, like, all three other Pokemon in it. Like, the one on your side and the two on the other side. Which, if I have Charizard out second, it's really good synergy. Really, really neat. Venusaur. Yeah, we're not keeping you in. Um... Alakazam. Mm, Alright. I've convinced myself. We're sending out Charizard. What move would he have against me? He would probably just use a poison type move, so it's still probably better to use just evolve him into Mega Charizard Y. And have the chance of one shotting him. Oh my god. What if she mega evolves? Oh my god, can you mega evolve? Can you make this battle a little bit interesting? We outspeed, so that doesn't mean that she doesn't have it. Charizard's definitely faster than Venusaur. Right? Dang, no, she doesn't mega evolve. This shouldn't one shot, honestly. Venusaur's so tanky. Sludge Bomb, dang. That's gonna hurt. No poison, we're fine. Alright, remind me, I need to switch out Golem from the front because Golem... Golem's more tanky than anything. And if I go through a battle like that, I just want to one-shot move on, on with my day. Dun, 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 dun. I just want to move on with my day. I don't want to sit there, like, farming for, like, an hour. Uh, let's go ahead and put... Janky out front because Janky's still behind. Janky and Alakazam are both just off of level 50. I remember he had Charizard. Alright, we gotta be quick. We gotta be quick. We gotta be quick. Okay, we're quick. I didn't want to battle him. I had no interest in it. I want to see. Yes, I'll use another lure. I want to see some cool. Po oh, I thought that was an Empoleon. I seriously thought that guy was an Empoleon. He's cosplaying, that's it. It's like the only option. Dude. There you go, Eevee. I thought I just had to run into it, but apparently I have to press A as well. I love how he... <laughs> it reminds... Eevee reminds me of Mencino for some reason. I think it's the tail. But like, just like that entire time, I was like, this is Mencino's job. Okay, now is there any Pokemon gonna pop out? I have a Luron. Those are the only... I've seen Zubat evolution form, Machop evolution form, and uh, Geodude's evolution form. When do I see something cool? I'm so done. I'm so done. Why is it when I just put out Janky, I always get like the bad matchups? I don't really have a good matchup for Hypno, but... Really? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'll just switch out to you. We have X Scissor on. Uh, Kabutops Tops, at least. They hit for super effective damage. I did teach him that off camera, I'm pretty sure. Oh, easy, eating that up. Why did he not go for a Psychic type move? Does he not have a Psychic type move? One shot, one shot, one shot, one shot. Dang it. 
Dude, you're an awful trainer. Like, really bad. I should have just gone for Aqua Jet, but oh well. I went for the smooth moves there. Anything cool you're gonna send out? Can I see something cool in this cave, please? Slow bro, that is an awesome Pokemon. Thank you for sending that out. Uh, sure, Electabuzz. I mean, we could keep out... It's not Stab, no. Let's switch out. Thunderbolt's really good against uh, Slowbro. Slowbro's got a lot of defense. Slowbro's very, very de physically defensive, especially defensive average. So this is fine. This is just gonna... This should be a two-shot. Thunder Punch might be close to a three-shot. I mean, it did more than I expected. This is gonna do a lot, though. Eating it up. It still smells bad over here. Dude, it smells like wet dog now. Mmm. This is where I work. This is where I sleep. This is where I eat, Link. Make sure it doesn't smell. This is my life in here. I need to smell as good as possible. As good as possible. That's a good one. Good one, H. Your mom will finally be proud of you. After that one. Eh, uh, whatever. I don't want to battle anyone extra. I just want to get through this. I don't want to get over-leveled is kind of the issue. I just want to collect Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get my shiny charm. That's what I really want. Okay, so I gotta move a boulder over here. I might actually throw up a rappel. Because there's nothing cool spawning, so I'm just guessing there's nothing cool in this place, apparently. There has to be, though. There's no way Victory Road is that lame. Oh, there's a new Pokemon. Hooray. It's one I've seen hundreds of times before. And he's blocking... Oh, god dang it. Why does life suck right now? Oh, there's an Onix. Finally saw one. Uh, I'll come back for that item later. Dude, Rh Rhydon's like the final boss over here. Maybe putting on a lure was a bad idea. Excuse me. I think I'm supposed to go up here. I don't really care too much for that item. <laughs> it's just it's too much effort. Uh, if I remember correctly, I have to go this way. There should be a battle over here. And then item doesn't he yeah there's a guy blocking that item if it's that important i'll worry about it later i don't think there's anything that's too amazing there might be like a max revive which would be cool why is officer jenny over here i mean i have to talk to her right oh she healed me cool thanks i expected nurse joy not her okay oh that's a good move not amazing but it's a good move so we gotta do this, right? And then move it back over. No. There's no cool Pokemon in here, apparently. It's all lame. And I'm the master of lame. And I'm still complaining about how lame... Oh. Lame it was. With this thing? For some reason, I feel like this unlocks... I don't know, it unlocks that. I thought it unlocks uh, Moltres for some reason. Actually, we might be catching Moltres right now. I don't remember how hard it was to get to Moltres. Ha ha ha, stop it. Was she right here? I am recording, right? I am recording. Okay, we should be good. PP Max is a good move. Good item. Yep. Found Moltres. I wish they made him harder to find. It's so easy. All right, guys, to end this episode off, we're going to catch Moltres. Maybe that's why Officer Jenny was right there. It was kind of cool how Moltres, like, came up to your face and checked you out. That was a really cool cutscene. I like the cutscenes. This game is beautiful. It's just too easy. I, I need it to be hard, which is why I need to do, like... Whenever I, a new Pokemon game comes out, I have to try, like, doing a challenge on it. It's not that fun to me if it's just easy. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Let's just send out Charizard. Eh, Golem. He's gonna have nothing good against Golem. And then we could do Stone Edge or Rock Slide, whatever I have on him, and kill him. Hmm. 
Yeah, this is gonna. Uh, I mean, it's special attack, so it might do a little bit. <laughs> oh, his stats rose too. All right. We should be able to take any. Uh... Okay, good. Now hit. Good. This is four times weak. Thank you. I'm <laughs> not gonna say anything. Dang it. I would have been so upset if I caught him there. I sent it a mile over. Dang it. It's so hard to hit like excellent throws on these guys. Whenever they're moving around, it's just so, so hard. You have to be so patient, and I don't have the patience. I'm just like, throw out the ball! Okay, do I start using raspberries? Sure. I got overzealous there. I, I see him get on range for like the middle throw and I'm just like, I'm just gonna throw it now. Oh. Didn't even hit a nice there. I'm just like spam the ball. He'll get in one of these, it's fine. How many ultra balls do I have? Nine. All right, I should start being more cautious, I guess. There we go. There's a great throw. Smart candy. What do you mean? Is Moltra smart? It's a fire chicken. It can't be that smart. Or maybe she's mastered the art of fire. Maybe it is that smart. A legendary bird Pokemon. As it flaps its flaming wings, even the night sky will turn red. It's kind of cool. Pokedex entry. I'm not the biggest fan of Moltres, but I do like a lot of the lore behind the legendary birds. I think it's cool. The legendary birds as a whole are awesome. That's my take on them. Okay, we got Moltres. We did all that kind of stuff. I'm going to end the episode here. I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you are enjoying the series. Ah, I tried avoiding them. Next episode might be our final... Final episode. I don't know how long it'll take me to beat the Elite Four. And the Pokemon Champion. There is a Pokemon Champion. Who is it going to be? Who is it going to be? I don't know, comment section. I just don't know. But anyways, guys, hope you did enjoy. Get out of here. <gasps>